Hey guys, it's Dingle here again. So, what this video is going to cover is going to be what your first steps to growing your farm should be. So we're going to assume you've already got your crops rotating through, we're doing soybeans, wheat, whatever you want to do. You've got your equipment set up. Now you're ready to start kind of growing, maybe getting some more fields, getting more advanced equipment. We'll go over getting additional fields today in this video. So the first thing that you want to do is kind of come and figure out which field you want. Um, I would advise not getting just a super massive field to start out with. Um, so the best way to do that is going to be to kind of come over here and look in your map. Um, okay so look at your map and see what's around you um i would make sure that there's not a field that's ready to harvest that requires equipment that you don't already have otherwise you have to go to the shop and rent something or whatever else it won't really be a good profitable decision for you so we already got equipment to run soybeans and fertile and uh, canola wheat that kind of stuff so we got this guy here on field 19 and he has sugar beets. So one way to get around that is you can go down here and you can actually do missions for these people, these uh, AIs in here. I always put my vehicle on the other side of the road so I don't get hit and they don't show sure hit crossing the road. Okay, so we can come harvest this guy's field and he'll actually pay us to harvest his field. You'll click the left stick as indicated. Um, what you'll do is sugar beets are kind of difficult to do. So we will go ahead and harvest for this guy. You can see he'll pay us 13,000. Another additional benefit is every time that you harvest a field, they uh, the field will get cheaper and cheaper and you can harvest it, you can plow it, fertilize it, seed it, whatever it needs doing so this will kind of give us a good opportunity also to show you how to um, kind of operate different equipment I think this goes on the front from this direction but I'm not certain over here grab this guy hit B to attach the front so sugar anything uh, either sugar beets or potatoes you have to uh, first cut off the tops remove the tops and then you need to uh, then you can actually harvest it so some harvesters will allow you to do both and then some harvesters like you have to kind of you can do it on a tractor and you just have to have multiple attachments so as you can see in the lower right hand corner I'm on the rear harvester right now um, I also need to activate the front top remover so the way that you do that is you will hit X under change tool selection now you can see I'm operating the front so I'll just have to turn it on Mode. Now we're ready to start harvesting. So we'll do some video editing for y'all and skip this so y'all don't have to sit here and watch me do this. And then we will. Then we'll go um, harvesting sugar beets for this guy. Another side note this is a great way to experiment with new equipment and technology if you're not sure. If you want to get into one, just find a field that has it and where the AI is already growing that, and then you can kind of experiment to see if it's something you want to do. Also, you cannot hire a helper to do this task. And you don't have to get all the way done. I got about 95% and it gave me the completion. You get a little bit of bonus money too if you complete it in under the required amount of time. Here. 
So we'll just go ahead and buy this field. I could sit here and fertilize it and do the other stuff, but we'll go ahead and buy it and then we can get it planted in our uh, soybeans. So we'll go ahead and do that. So now we've bought the field. If we go to our financials, we can see that it's going to be under um, land purchases. Field job income, you can see we made some money from that. All right, so that <clears throat> wraps up this video. Make sure you like it if you like the video. If you want me to cover anything else about this topic, make sure to leave a, you leave a comment. Other than that, y'all have a nice day.